Welcome everyone, you've turned on haptic keyboard feedback in your iPhone, but it's not working, right? You go to do some typing and you feel nothing. Real quick, if you have not turned on the haptic keyboard feedback, I'll have a dedicated tutorial in the description. This is for people who have turned on the haptic keyboard feedback, but it's not working. So I'm going to show you two fixes. The first fix is you're going to head over to the home page of the settings app. Once you're here, I want you to scroll all the way down until you see sounds and haptics. You then want to scroll all the way down to the keyboard feedback area. And so we are now in the same place where we originally turned on the haptic keyboard feedback. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn off the sound option and leave the haptic on. Then you're gonna type on the keyboard. Then you're gonna open up settings again. You're gonna turn back on the sounds and now try the haptic keyboard feedback again. For some that will work, if that does not work, then let's do the second fix. So we're gonna head over to the home page of settings. We're then gonna find where it says accessibility. From here, we're gonna find where it says touch, and then we're going to scroll all the way down until we see vibration. If this toggle is on, turn it off and back on. If this toggle is off, you must turn it on. This toggle is what controls vibration in your iPhone. So if it's not on, then the haptic keyboard feedback won't work. So now give the keyboards a try. For most people, that should solve the issue. If that does not solve the issue, then you have two options. The first option is you're going to go to the homepage of the settings app you're gonna find where it says general. You're then gonna to scroll to the bottom. You're gonna tap on shutdown. You're then gonna slide to shut down your device, okay? After 10 seconds, you're gonna press and hold the power button to turn back on your iPhone. If after the restart, which is, you know, powering down, powering back on, the haptic keyboard feedback isn't working and you've tried the previous two solutions, then your only option is to wait for a brand new software update, okay? To check for software updates, go to the home page of settings. Then you're gonna find where it says general. Then you're gonna see software update. And when a new update is available, you will be notified in the home page of settings here. Okay, you see where this one is, it will say software update available. You'll just need to wait for that software update to come out. And once it comes out, upgrade your software and that should 100% solve the issue. With that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.